Hello friends. In this video we will learn in detail about computer virus. Computer virus is a program that is created intentionally to corrupt or delete data stored in a computer by erasing information available on its hard disk. The full form of virus is Vital Information Resources Under Siege Vital Information Resources Under Siege Once a virus becomes active, it starts getting loaded and saved in the computer memory. It travels to the hard disk and system files and makes them corrupt. Virus programs are self-replicating and are continuously expanding their reach by infecting more and more computer files, resulting in loss of speed and destruction of data. Trojan horse, worm, malware and spyware are some important terms which are associated with virus programs but are actually different from virus programs. Trojan horse harmless but destructive in nature. Mostly it erases a disk. It do not replicate themselves. They can spread only when they copied to another system. Worm is special type of virus which is self-replicate and spread across networks. It copies and multiplies itself by using computer networks and security flaws. They can overload network resources very quickly, which slow down in data transmission due to consumption of network bandwidth. Malware is made up of two words malicious and software. A software that enters into a computer and damages it without the knowledge of user. It may steal information from the system. Spyware is a type of malware that is installed on a computer without the knowledge of owner in order to collect the owner's private information. These includes internet surfing habits, visited web pages, keystrokes, passwords and other valuable data. Sometimes they also change computer settings that results in slow connection speed and wrong functionality of other program. Types of computer viruses Boot viruses Program file viruses Macro viruses And batch file viruses Boot viruses infect computer systems by copying code either to the boot sector or master boot records. During startup, the virus is loaded into memory and will infect any non-infected disks accessed by the system. A boot sector virus usually alters the boot sector program and replaces the default program with its own corrupted version or by copying it elsewhere. Examples Disk Killer and Stone Virus Program file viruses Viruses infect executable files such as those with the extension like exe, com, sys etc. Their intention is to cause permanent damage or make them unusable. The virus overwrites code or inserts infected code into an executable file. 
Examples Sunday and Cascade Macroviruses infect documents such as MS Word or MS Excel and cause a sequence of actions to be performed automatically when the application is started. They add their code to the macros associated with documents, spreadsheets and other data files. Batch file viruses are a kind of script file in DOS and Windows and consists of a series of commands to be executed by the command line interpreter. They can be used to write malware and viruses. Example fork bomb malware which opens the same program so many times that the computer is executed from resources. Sources of computer viruses From CD and pen drives From the internet From email from a computer network. Ten signs that your computer has a virus. You are unable to access the hard drive when booting from the floppy drive. The computer's hard drive constantly runs out of free space. Strange graphics are shown on your computer. The CD disk drive or hard drive runs when you are not using it. Programs act erratically. Program sizes keep altering. Computer programs take longer to load than normal. Conventional memory is less than it used to be and you can't explain it. Strange sounds or beeping noises come from the computer or keyboard. Files have strange names you don't identify. Ten safe computing practices. Every computer should be equipped with some antivirus program. Scan your computer on regular basis. Update your antivirus software on a regular basis. Keep back up. Turn off email preview. Scan CD disks. Protect your CD disks. Scan downloaded files. Scan all email attachments. Beware of email attachments from unknown sources. Visit our channel for better understanding. Link of the videos given in description.